Hi, my name is Bryony and welcome to my mini kitchen. Today we are going to be making something really easy. We are going to be making hot chocolate on a spoon. So our ingredients are so simple. We've got 225 grams of milk chocolate, 60 grams of icing sugar and 30 grams of cocoa powder. Um, some things you will need is a silicon based ice tray, um, a couple of spoons or sticks will probably do and then one disposable piping bag. So first thing we need to do is melt the chocolate. We're going to do this indirectly over a bain-marie. Just light a small pan with a little bit of water. It's got about a centimetre of water or so in, in there. I'm going to pop the chocolate on top. Uh, with a spatula, it should happen quite quickly. Once everything starts to melt, it'll all just melt all together. And we just need to melt everything down. So while our chocolate is melting, we're going to take a large bowl and just place both our dry ingredients in, so our icing sugar and our cocoa powder. Just want to take a big whisk and just mix them together. Now, all our, our chocolate is melted, we're taking it off of our hob. Careful, it will be hot. And we are just going to pour all of this straight in to our dry mixture. So now we just need to incorporate it all, mix everything together. It will be quite a thick mixture, it's definitely meant to be like that. So it might just take a few whole stirs. We're going to take our icing bag and a little trick is taking a, a pint glass or just any glass and putting in your icing bag and folding it over. This will make it so much easier just to fill the whole icing bag. We've now got our little silicon ice cube tray, our icing bag with our chocolate mixture. I'm just going to grab some scissors and cut off the end. So just squeeze it down and we're just going to start filling our ice cube tray. So it will be quite thick, so you have to squeeze quite hard. But these are a really perfect thing to make if you wanted just something simple to make with your kids or as a gift, you can decorate them however you like. So as they are hot chocolate, we're gonna put marshmallows on the top of ours. So I've filled half of this tray, but we've got plenty left for more. You just want to smack them on the table a little bit so they even out. And they're about half full, halfway full and then this is the fun bit. So I've got some wooden spoons here. Simply place the wooden spoon in the middle. As it's quite thick, it should hold it all up. And then you get to decorate them with whatever you want to decorate with. We're going to do marshmallows. And now they're all done. So all you have to do is put them in the fridge overnight and let them set and then they will become something like this that I made earlier and they should just come straight out of the mould and be hot chocolate on a stick. Now next time you go to have a hot chocolate rather than just pouring in a bit of powder you've got real chocolate and marshmallows ready to go. So I've got myself a mug full of just and just simply stir. As you stir all the hot chocolate in, the marshmallows, which were stuck to the top, will come and float straight to the surface and it will turn into a really rich, creamy hot chocolate. And there you have an amazing, freshly homemade hot chocolate with marshmallows. Oh, so good. So creamy. So rich, so chocolatey. Thank you so much for watching my video and I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Please like underneath and also in the comment box tell me what you'd like to see me make. Also please subscribe and I'll see you again next time.